I thought to myself and I was like, I should make this video. It's important. I want to talk to you about this exercise that I've given on my Instagram. Now, English is amazing. I want to tell you this before I start speaking about it. Please make sure to understand that the language is a skill. It needs a lot of practice from you. And some things, when you're doing them on your own way, might not be successful to achieve a goal on your English language in order to speak fluently or this and that. Keep that in mind. You have to remember this. Sometimes things does not go the way you are thinking that they should go. Meaning that if you're thinking of an English language and you're trying to understand a vocabulary and you then, what do you do? You put it in your own language and then translate. It's like, okay, this is my native tongue and this is English and I'm translating. It, 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 it's not working like that. And that's why probably you are making wrong choices and you are not doing good on your test or uh, your English language in general. So you have to pay attention to something. Never translate an English word into your own mother tongue. It's not helpful. It's not going to help you. What will help you for sure is translating this English word into the, its meaning in English language. So this word give you three, five sentences probably as an understanding of what is this word, when and where that you should use this word. That's important about English language. And trust me, I've learned that after a long period of practicing and also cutting off my mother tongue, uh, the language that I was born with, and then using the actual English language each and every day. So remember, understand the vocabulary. Do not just see the meaning in your own native tongue. I was like, okay, I know this word, what does it mean? No, 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 you have to dig deeper. Sometimes it took me, sorry, sometimes it, it takes for me to understand the word and use it properly an hour or so. So, you know, do the homework, okay? So that your English could be much more better than you possibly could imagine. So yeah, let's keep it up and uh, keep on practicing.